Curiosity is the largest and most capable rover ever sent to Mars. It launched on November 26, 2011 and landed on the Martian surface on August 5, 2012. Since then, the rover has made significant progress working on Mars. Curiosity rover brought us the first evidence that surface water once ran on Mars. NASA's rover found smooth and rounded rocks near its landing site in Gale Crater. Team scientists confirmed that those rocks have been carried down by water, broken down and very much smoothed out, suggesting that a steady stream of flowing water once existed there. The same rocks that indicate a lake was present also indicate there was very little carbon dioxide in the air to help keep a lake unfrozen. Curiosity has told us that ancient Mars had the right chemistry to support living microbes. When the rover drilled its first rock a fine-grained mudstone, it found the elements that are considered to be the building blocks for life. The moving laboratory found sulfur, nitrogen, hydrogen, oxygen, phosphorus and carbon, as well as clay minerals that primitive microbes could eat for food. Data from Curiosity's radiation assessment detector have told us that radiation levels on Mars are safe for humans. The rover has measured radiation levels comparable to those experienced by crew members aboard the International Space Station. However, getting there in the first place remains a problem. During its 9-month voyage to Mars, Curiosity experienced radiation levels that could exceed NASA's career radiation limit for astronauts. One of the team members said that experiencing that level of radiation is like getting a whole body CT scan once every 5 or 6 days. But with this data in hand, engineers can build spacecraft and spacesuits that are able to protect humans on a deep space mission. Once upon a time, Mars used to have a lot more oxygen than scientists thought. NASA's Curiosity rover observed high levels of manganese oxides in Martian rocks. This evidence could indicate that high levels of oxygen once existed on the red planet during a period when the planet was warmer and liquid water was flowing. Curiosity has surprised scientists around the world by the variety of soil and rock it has found in the Gale Crater. The moving laboratory found different types of gravel, streambed deposits, an unusual type of possibly volcanic rock, water transported sand dunes, mudstones and cracks filled with mineral vines. All of these have improved our understanding of ancient Mars.